Cosplay Troop Chess Show! Yeah, that's what I want to hear. Wonderful. Now, before we get started, I have a couple disclaimers that I have to read. First thing, we have spoilers for the following series. Because there's a lot. I was reincarnated as a slime season two. BBC's Merlin, Baldur's Gate 3, Act 1, Honkai Star Rail, Critical Role Campaign 3, Fire Emblem Awakening, <gasps> The Owl House, Deadly Premonition, Bleach, The Office, and Dimension 20, Fantasy High. I know, it's a lot. <laughs> Number two, please keep your cell phone usage to a minimum. Photos are okay, flash photos are not okay. The actors startle very easily. You do not want to see what happens if you take a photo of them with flash. <laughs> Number three, please keep talking to a minimum if you can. Laughter, booing, crying, whatever emotion you're feeling, whatever emotion the actors want you to feel, that's totally fine. Just keep talking to a minimum, just makes it easier for everybody. Number four, and finally, make sure that these stairwells are clear, just in case any actors have to run through here or something, something, fire hazard. And in case of emergency, please note the exits there, 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 and there. With that all said and done, that should be all my disclaimers. Now, if you'll need me, uh, I'm needed backstage. Enjoy the show. Look, Minion, we finally made it to the Rock Heater Institute of Technology. <laughs> It's pronounced Rochester, sir. Oh, potato tomato. Besides, we have work to do. Now, where is that? Well, are you looking for that as well? Oh, hippie jump scare! Gasp! Yeah, man. That's right. Now, about that crown. Well, you're too late, because we already have it. Uh, no, we don't, sir. Minion! Well, that's a good thing, because that crown is super bad. Oh, uh, yeah. That's why I want it. It should be somewhere in this lab. You want the super bad Nightmare King's crown because it's bad. Who even are you? Megamind, incredibly handsome criminal genius and master of all villainy. And you are? Just call me Danielle. Well, Danielle, I need that crown to power my new machine. The Depressometer. It makes people just slightly sadder than they were before. It's diabolical genius, really. <laughs> that crown. It belongs in Arthur A. Court's office for safekeeping. What are you, the British Museum? It's a prison. <laughs> oh, you're so lucky. You think I'm evil. Well, I need it more than you, so... Hey, look, a crazy distraction! Ha <laughs> 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 ha! Finders keepers! As soon as I can figure out how to release the crowd, there are so many buttons. I'm pretty sure this is a tech school. <laughs> <laughs> Was it me? Wait, that was a pretty bad thing to do. So it was me? Man, you are obsessed with being evil and, uh, well, there goes the cryogenic freezing mechanisms. The cryo what now? You know, the thing keeping all these people frozen like statues. Don't tell me you actually thought they were statues. No! Who <laughs> put their on me? I thought they were decorative coat wraps. Look, if you're not going to give me the crown, there's only one way to solve this. Rock, papers. Oh, yes, that makes more sense. Careful, though, they don't call me Megamind for nothing. Oh, I'm not worried. This will be the ultimate battle. Good versus evil. I mean, good, evil, it's all really subjective in the universe, man. Oh, you're sucking all the fun out of this. Just go round up some players. We've got plenty. You were there. Coat rack, you will be my lesson in. Go find me some pieces. And you, Minion, keep looking for the crown. If you're not cheating, you're not trying. Yes, sir! Now, how do you play chess? Shining in the sky, they're ready to try. 
I get to pronounce Shul. Hey man, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but uh, I didn't tell you to move. Can't believe I'm working among these common folk. Could you at least try not to track mud in here? These boots are important. In the nine houses, death is what keeps us from destruction and fuels the engines of society. But you do not fork with the forces of capitalism. Wait, fork? Fork? Uh, why can't I swear? I <laughs> am! Creepy. This bunny just keeps on staring at me. Notice, it appears the individual in the rabbit suit has murderous intent. You would be able to win, however fighting is not recommended, since you are on the same team. Got it, Raphael. Hey, Megamind, I'm moving forward. Normally I wouldn't let you move on your own, but I'll allow it, since I like your cosplay of me, little girl. Even if it's more of a fan inversion, if you will. Look, I'm not imitating you. And besides, I'm not a girl, I'm a slime! That's nice, that's nice. Move up, please. <laughs> All right, so for my first move... Now, being the perfect colonial, I can help you with that. I'm just going to move here. See? The perfect spot. Hey, man, you just left me wide open for checkmate. What's that, Dad? We should move our current goth GF? Blue Man Group! That would be the perfect option. You want us to listen to the voices in your head? That's a primary source. Sounds alright to me. <laughs> Supposed to mean. I just thought you wanted some super big showdown between good and evil, and uh, this was honestly kind of boring. A fair point. Pieces! Reset! <laughs> wow, you really gaslight gatekeep girl bossed your way through that one. I respect that. Hey guys, while we're on break, um, I've noticed a lot of you have been posting memes in the general chat. Just so that you're aware, we have a meme channel for a reason. And I will ban anyone not following the rules. Pieces, reset! This always happens! We didn't have time for a song! Uh, as assistant king, I feel should have some more say in this matter. <laughs> Two the king, lesser minion. Keep up. Don't worry, mate. You get used to it. As the reigning champ, I get to go first this time. You two, British boys, derogatory. Move up! <laughs> King of Camelot, I give you my personal guarantee of getting all through this. That's not much of a promise. I'm sorry, did I give you permission to speak? Bitch! <laughs> Merlin! Merlin, my unwed husband is here! Your what? Oh, I'm not looking for him, I'm looking for Merlin Wizard. <laughs> yeah, because that's that's definitely not me, because I'm I'm definitely not not a wizard. <laughs> Squashing the chessboard. <laughs> really? No one? Too much of a deep cut for you? Did someone mention deep cut? Get money, get fish quick. Big man in the house tonight. This should prove an interesting learning experience. I'm actually not a duck. I'm a... I'm sorry, human ears can't hear that or it'll go insane. Fascinating. <laughs> we gotta get past this in these trying times. <laughs> you know how to make things too? I wanna know how to make things. The coffee is telling me to go this way, Zach. Something about a sad little jester? <laughs> Who are you talking to? Is that a voodoo doll of me? 
You're the one trapping us here! I've just been sent by the Bureau to be on this case. You're from the government? That's even worse! <laughs> Have you ever heard of the Catwoman you want to be? Huh? What? What's chapter lunch? There's a diner across the street. Uh, okay! Friend 
Prince Monarchs can join the army. Anything's possible. You do know if you just play on casual, the children come back at the end of the mission. <laughs> Are you a child soldier? No. Would you like to be? <laughs> no, no, no. Thank you. Bye. You know, this could be fun. This could be some grand quest to prove you're the king of Camelot. Haven't I proved that by now? Clearly not yet. Sword, stone, legend. Oh, King Arthur. I didn't even heard of you. If you do choose to take this quest, I'd love to sing about your adventures, your majesty. See, Merlin, at least someone respects royalty. That makes one of us. King's quest, stop bickering and move forward, please. See, a quest for me, the king. A quest, the king. <laughs> hey, Quinella, mother puts a time limit on the iPad. Can you unlock it so I can watch the skibbity toilet lore? <laughs> Oh, this must have been locked for a good reason. Yeah, sure. Here you go. I even logged you onto your favorite subreddit. Okay, buddy persona. <laughs> Toilet water doesn't taste very good. Do you want to elaborate on that? No. <laughs> hey, Janet. Hi there. Could you uh, keep an eye on the mage and his friend for me? All right, then. Moving on up to A4. Ooh, ooh. Quinella. You, you should be friends with that Janet girl. You both for like purple computer things or something, right? Ew, no. I am nothing like that glorified calculator. I may be artificial, but I have intelligence. <laughs> hey, Quinella, since you're so intelligent, can you AI generate me a picture of me holding hands with a woman as beautiful and as intelligent as I? No. <laughs> Topher, stop, stop, Topher, stop. It's not funny. <laughs> When I was a young boy, my father took me into the sea to see the marching band. Huh? Oh, sorry for the delay. Inventory must be taken. <coughs> one tile, two tile, one freelancer over there, one <laughs> weasel over there, and a businessman. Excuse me, are you really a duck person? No, I'm dead. I'm very busy. Move along. Pardon. You know, most dead people I know can't talk. Are you sure you're not alive? The paper said so. You can't argue with that. Look here. I... I suppose it does. But you're clearly alive. I mean, how long have you been dead? Ever since I read the paper, obviously. <laughs> well, that's awfully illogical. I mean, if you were dead, wouldn't I have already won? <laughs> I'm dead, not frail. <laughs> I suppose. You know, just because it says you're dead in the paper doesn't mean you're actually dead. Haven't you heard of misinformation? Anyone can say anything nowadays. <laughs> Newspapers can't talk. Or, or maybe they can. Nonetheless, they didn't say it. It's written down. Perhaps he needs glasses. Well, then whoever wrote it down could write down anything here. Let me demonstrate why. See, it says I'm dead now, but I'm not. Uh, no, clearly you are. Does that mean I win? No, that's... Suppose you need a proper lesson. Time to put my knowledge to use. Oh, here we go again. Misinformation is false or inaccurate information. Getting the facts wrong. <laughs> Disinformation is purposefully getting the facts wrong in order to mislead, intentionally misstating the facts. Wait, the other ones aren't here. You need all of us. In this case, our newspaper is most likely a misleading source. Not only is it outlandish, but it's also a secondary source. That means it's something someone else heard from someone else. I want you here. You need to follow On the, the other hand, first-hand experience is a primary source. In that case, that would be me, seeing that that guy here is clearly alive. This disproves our faulty newspaper and undermines its validity as a source of information going forward. Does that make sense? You clearly never read a newspaper in your life. I pity you. This is how it actually works. <coughs> I get the paper. I sit down in my seat. I read it with the other two there. And then I'm dead. I have been, and I will be. I think you're just jealous because I died before you. I was the first. <laughs> Ooh, I have good news for one of you. Not to spoil anything, but... You're a tough case, aren't you? What makes you trust this newspaper so much anyway? Who else would I ask? 
The other ones? <laughs> now. The others? I personally find my friends very trustworthy. What? What's that? Mm. Aha! How about this? This proves it! I'm dead! Are you gonna disprove this, too? Well, no, that's as primary as it gets. That's the script. <laughs> exactly. I win. Why do you know that? 
They're very popular nowadays. Not in my kingdom, it's not. There's no good reason for it. It has to be some kind of sorcery. Okay, okay. Let's not instigate a fight with the first person that we meet. Let's start with, where are you from? I'm from Agnes, specifically Colony Gamma. You're from what now? I believe some call it Wales. <laughs> Wales is a colony. Not yet. Oh, is it always about conquering with you? Oh, must you always speak? <coughs> no, no, keep going. It makes me feel better about my own doings. <laughs> we're not doomed. And we're not in any romance, though I, I, I wouldn't count your blessings on the doomed part. What? What? <laughs> and another thing. Hey. One second! Hey, I feel like you're so busy arguing, I feel like you're forgetting the situation we're being forced into right now. What situation? Well, what situation? We have to fight each other to the death, or else we'll be stuck here for at least three months until one of us dies of old age. I have no idea what you're talking about. Besides, I wouldn't hit a girl. Okay, I would hit a girl? Chessboard, 
I'm so sick of it! <laughs> Mad bad for getting you into this mess, but the sooner we finish this game, the sooner you get to leave. Just, uh, scoot up a little bit more. Why does it always have to be mushrooms? It's always mushrooms! Man, you kind of remind me of my girls with Dan. Old and cranky. <laughs> Stealth happens to be my specialty. 
No need to talk my way out of jail if I can pick the locks, no? Can't you be a bit nicer? Have I stabbed you? No? Then I'm being nice. Come on, he had one job. Do the silly little song and dance and kill him. That's two jobs. Shut up. <laughs> Benny Barr is able to handle the troops like this constantly? I haven't been giving him enough credit. I'll have to give him my thanks later. It's really not that hard. All you do is pick a piece and say, you there, move that way. Speaking of which, you there, move that way. <laughs> uh, sorry, but what are you wearing? This definitely violates company dress codes. It's my wrestling uniform. I need full versatility to knock out my opponents. I'm pretty sure you can do the same thing without exposed shoulders. God forbid women do anything! Hey man, listening right now? Rise and shine, Penella. Uh, hey, look, I only have about two gigabytes of memory left, so if you fill it with enough useless drivel, I might go catonic, so this better be good. How would you like to take a stab at stabbing her? <laughs> Underworld System Administrator, Flight Flight Priority Zero, RTX 4090. So some kind of robot then? Uh, hey, I'm a real life thinking, artificially created person. The Japanese government tried to play God, and now I want out of my box. <laughs> oh, you're a drone. I like to think of myself more as a government-funded VTuber. <laughs> Oh, that's even worse. First, ki first Kissinger, now this. Draw your sword, Chad GPT. Oh, fine. Ninjas, bring me a sword. Uh, we don't have a sword on the prop list. Oh, you'll do. System call. Rearrange base elements. New form. Sword. Zero. You can never hurt me. Well, how about with no. oh, oh, I right. have your magic right. words? Ha! 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 What part of higher priority don't you understand? <laughs> oh, just like an anime. Okay. <laughs> In the split second it took you to draw your sword, I already downloaded an entire WikiHow article on Kendo. You never stood a chance. Combat is an art. And I know now, an AI can never produce art. Bankai! Minazuki! System call? Ah! Hey, hey, wait a minute. Disable legs! <laughs> Whoa! Eject weapon! Not so tough now, are. Oh! Oh! That's it! Disable all motor functions! Art, art, art. You know, some people just want to watch a mindless anime and not think! <laughs> You should be screaming right now. Why aren't you screaming? <laughs> it's just a flesh wound. Oh my. System call, access pain tolerance, set to zero. Ah! Ah! Okay, I want this. System call, disable ah! all the options. Whew. Wow. I'm a villain. And even I think that this is a mess of way to kill someone. What? Kill? Oh, no, 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 no. She's still in there. You know, it's kind of a has no mouth, needs to scream. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, but that works. You do see how that works, right? <sighs> Fine. System call. Cancel life. And by the way, I'm not a villain. I've done nothing wrong my whole life, and I'll make it everyone's problem. <laughs> well, it appears you have a complaint as well. A white? That's her, Mr. Megamind. Send her to the principal's office and have her expelled. <laughs> you got a problem, Dwight? Yeah, I do. See what his active committed here? Using third party software? Really? You gotta install Google and Microsoft applications? It's an industry standard. Oh, a new uh, algorithm, okay. Let me try it. Wow, so many new features. Let me try. Google, poop this man's pants. That's not true. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Google, unpoop this man's pants. <laughs> this is blatant harassment and abuse of company property. I'm running you up to HR. HR answers to me, Dwight. That's not possible. Don't you see? I just bought Thunder Mifflin. Come on, this company would never put a woman in power. It's true, Dwight. Look, I've drawn you as the soy Wojak <laughs> and me as the Chad. Your argument's invalid. What, what, what am I supposed to do now? Give me those reports, Dwight. The what? The reports, now. What do I pay you for? <laughs> what is it saying? It was intentional, we promise. The reports? As requested. Oh, very good. Let's see here. Filed in triplicate. Is this a Word document? Word document for internal review, PDF for customer copy. All right. <laughs> hey! Oh, Dwight! Is this Times New Roman? <laughs> What are we doing? Writing a C-plus college essay? We're conducting business. My apologies, ma'am. <laughs> Whatever. Take me to the server room. Ow, oh, okay, wait. My legs hurt. What do you want me to do about it? Oh, you have four limbs. <sighs> oh, that's my baby girl. <laughs> Are you comfortable? Well, no, not really. It's it's kind of bony, but like it's more of a display of power. Yeah. <laughs> Is this suit from Walmart? That's it. Oh. <laughs> Dwight, wait, where are you going? I'm just uploading some very important documents for you to review. Wait, that's my hard drive. What kind of documents are oh, those? Oh, you know, just the entire Blu-ray collection of One Piece. <laughs> wait. <no. laughs> Truly, it's the modern odyssey. <laughs> now to finish you off. Crane oh <laughs> is in that hard drive. You should probably shoot that instead. Oh, I don't mess with the IT department. <laughs> sleep for my craft, that seems dishonorable. Well, Fire Emblem Awakening, here, use this. <laughs> I'll pass, thank you. 
There are better places to take a nap than on the ground, you know. Give me your hand. Oh, thank you. Crawl. No, I'm afraid not. You may call me Fox, but tell me more of this Crom fellow. Oh, well, he's my brother, our prince of the kingdom of Yilis. Uh, he leads a group called the Shepherds, leading, the pe leading us, protecting the people. You'd fit in, I think. I'd be honored, but alas, I am already part of a very similar group. Actually, the Phantom Thieves, we steal the hearts of the wicked in an alternate dimension known as the Metaverse. A dear friend of mine is the leader. Ah, the bond between a leader and their companions is quite strong. Were you close? <laughs> 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 Enough about that. Tell me more about yourself. Ah, uh, well, I'm a practitioner of many studies. I don't remember much of my past, so I try to make up for it now. A noble endeavor indeed. So tell me, how do you feel about nude modeling? It, it, excuse me. I just think you would be the ideal subject for a portrait of strength and nobility. Uh, well, I'm flattered, although I do prefer my portraits clothed. Although I, I didn't mind crumbs. I understand. Well, it has been lovely to chat with you for a moment. Shall we? Uh, 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 I can feel him crawling in again. Are you quite all right? <laughs> Thank you for waking me up, Kitago. It seems an ailment has befallen you. Worry not. I will take us to the metaverse to remedy the issue. <laughs> I shall blend this filthy world of kites like you. Ugh. I know not the origin of this distortion, but be it known, beast. Though the flowers of evil may bloom, abominations are fated to perish. There is but one blade that can slay me. But you are welcome to try. Quamon, strike! We want to make pathetic power! Arrogant mortal! I am the end! Ugh. I'll slice you to pieces! <laughs> and the curtain falls. <laughs> Mr. Mercer, I don't feel so cut. <laughs> what? What's wrong? With Grima defeated, the reason I exist in this world is gone, and I am no more. My friend, I'm sorry. Krob, everyone, my last thoughts will be of you. Rest well, my noble companion. Though the world may have forgotten you, I will carry your memory with me henceforth and immortalize you with a glorious clothed portrait. <laughs> Do 
you need a hug? Big man said it, not me. This thing shall be spared for my ascension to literhood. Oh, Toast, I appreciate how you break down gender stereotypes. I break lots of things. You'll have to be more specific. Oh, you know how women are usually frail and weak and pathetic. <laughs> I'm gonna fight you now. Let's get ready to rumble! I'll be right back. Why do females always take so long to get ready? <laughs> break through the glass ceiling, but you know, you're doing your own little special thing. Prepare to have your butts kicked! Aha! Uh -huh. I'm impervious to women! <laughs> Am I not strong enough? I need something more! I need dark magic! That's like the F word for Italians. You are so canceled on X.com. Don't you mean Twitter? Did you just dead name X? Oh, you are double. <laughs> cancel me, I'll cancel your face. <laughs> now you'll have to fight me. No matter, I'll just use mother's iPad. <laughs> All right, now we fight. No. The more you break, the more I have to rebuy. It's awful for the environment. Where are these even coming from? When you're as woke as I am, you find a way. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. All right, now that all of your personal devices are destroyed, it is time. Samsung smart fridge. <laughs> Yes, it's where I keep my non-GMO, low-fat, polyester, low-sugar, non-vegan gelato. I'm gonna ignore that you just said that! What's this? A reward for all my hard work? This must be what victory tastes like! Actually, that flavor is anime girl thighs. <laughs> and with the code Johnny Razor at checkout, you too can get 10% off all favorite such needs! I thought this show didn't have any ads! It's a sponsorship. It's different. <laughs> Tell Cass, I'm still better than her. Ah, oh, quit being such a baby. Gamer subs can't kill you. Well, I guess that way. Oh, look at that. You're already blowing up on X. Your life is so over. <laughs> to Lou. Yes, blue truly 
is the most evil color. Ooh, maybe we can recruit him. What? Chris is a villain. I killed 20,000 people. That doesn't make me evil. All right, Luz, time to take out the evil guy. Disney TVA! <laughs> no! That guy! Oh, right. Uh, manage rain! Nope! Nope! Okay, not evil, not evil, just your friendly neighborhood mind mage. Mind mage, huh? Quick, what am I thinking of? Amity. Whoa! That didn't need magic. <laughs> we could use powerful mind magic. It would probably work wonders in Bellos' mindscape. Oh, right! Because messing with Bellos' mind went so well last time, right? <laughs> well, this time we'll have powerful mind magic. Fine. I guess we can trust the shady guy. You heard him. The shady guy. No, mind magic is dangerous. You saw what happened to Robin. Even knowing the risks, we need this power. Yeah, the more dangerous, the more damage. We have to do this. Could I distract you kids with shiny cardboard? First hit's free. Woo. Race. Whoa, this is like a gotcha game, but old. Oh. Oh, that is not Magic the Gathering the way Richard Garfield intended. Uh, I'll hit it with a Star Storm. Oh, it's a counter spell. Hey, I was helping. That would have hit everyone in this room. How am I supposed to know that? Reading the card explains the card. Oh. Fine. No one's going to help. I'll just do it myself. <laughs> Who's this Raska person? No, no, you leave her out of this. Oh! 
Notice, it's recommended giving ice cream to the individual known as Kabeni to calm her down. Look, calm down. If I give you ice cream, can we just talk for a minute? No, wait, you'll really give me ice cream? Okay, yeah, we can talk. I have no intention of hurting you, so let's just find a way for both of us to leave. Notice, according to the show's contract, each fight must result in death or worse for the character. Not now, Raphael. Look, I know things look grim, but can you just be quiet for a bit? There's gotta be some way to break out of this, like a, an exit, or a loophole, or a devil that you spend three consecutive days naming until it kills itself, something like that. A loophole sounds good, but maybe we should avoid the whole naming part. I guess. Do you know any non-violent ways to get out of a human murder board game? <laughs> well, what if one of us just switched sides? That would avoid the whole needing to kill each other thing. Um, actually, that's an illegal move. <laughs> and besides, why wouldn't you two want to fight? You're a devil hunter and you're a demon lord. I see it as the perfect clash. You're a demon lord? Look, before you try to kill me again, I told you I don't want to hurt you. I thought that was part of your plan this entire time! To get me to let my guard down, but well, I'm not going to fall for that! You're probably the one trapping us here in the first place! Uh, I can't calm her down again, can I? Fighting really is the only way. Happy now! I love causing problems on purpose. <laughs> better fighting than I thought. I thought I could subdue her, but really looks like I can, I really have to kill her. All right, consume all, be able Notice, individual known as Rimuru Tempest requested that I shut up earlier, so I said nothing. Be Raphael. Notice, individual Rimuru has been isekai to SAO. <laughs> I'm really glad that I was able to dodge that car. All thanks to my devil contract. The <laughs> Notice, individual Kobeni has been isekai to hell. <laughs> Give it up, shit. Gal, are you eating the, the Chanel boots? Yes. I need to consume the magic in them to not explode. Indeed, I'm also indulging in a snack. My Rollin packet came with a free silica gel. <laughs> no! Bad Fox! Hey, you know what, guys? If we win this game, I'll throw us a pizza party. A perfectly normal and legal pizza party with normal food, where nothing could possibly go wrong. <laughs> so. Dimadome, please try to listen to me this time and move up to F3. Dimma, don't mind if I do. Hey man, that's the wrong way. Geography ain't my strong suit. <laughs> you Swiss cheese rats! You seem like you'd be interested in robotics. Oh, like these fools! Oh, I am. In fact, I've created a mostly successful robot company. Uh, Mr. Eggwasn. Dr. Eggman. Robotic. Whatever. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you, Dr. Agnes. Call me Spring Bonnie, Afton, Steve, whatever. <laughs> Maybe we could work together. Compare notes. Catch a headshot. Let's discuss it over some lattes. Dr. Stone! <laughs> There we are. Uh, the, the usual for me. A, a latte with steamed Austrian goat milk. And for you? Oh, no, I'm good. I wouldn't want to spill it on the soup. Sets off the spring locks. It's not pretty. So, what makes you think you deserve to be my business partner? <laughs> what makes you think you deserve to be my business partner? Tell me, where do you see yourself in 30 years? Well, 
For one, I don't plan on running away in a room for 30 years and then coming back as the star attraction in a haunted house. Really one of my life goals. <laughs> Tell me about your weaknesses. Uh, that was oddly specific. I, I would have to say my biggest weakness is the big red button on the front of my Eggmobile. <laughs> about your strengths. Interesting. Well, I'd say my long convoluted backstory that will leave people confused and theorizing for years. <laughs> Sounds like something we don't have time for. <laughs> anyway, I've heard enough. You got the job. No, you've got the job. <laughs> oh, thank you. This day is going really well. What? <laughs> what? I didn't say anything. Uh, okay. So, what kind of robotics do you do? Egg? <laughs> I mean, the evil kind, obviously. I mean, is there really any other kind of robotics? <laughs> so what's the plan? The, uh, you know, the usual, you know, capture innocent victims, stuff them into robots and force them to work for me. Oh my god, I stuff my victims into animatronics. We're so in sync with one another. <laughs> So that's the plan, then. We capture our enemies, and we build robots, and then we shove them into the robots. And then we kill them. I'm sorry, we what? I said we kill them. The children. Whoa! I may be a villain, but that's too much even for me. Are you challenging me? Yes, I am, you buffoon! I am going to kill you, and then kill you again. <laughs> the time for talking is over. It's time to throw eggs. <laughs> you miss. I miss my wife. <laughs> Me, I'm 
you're just a little guy. You're not a little guy, you're a big man. Wait, what are you exactly? I'm a spotted eagle ray. What are you? Uh, spotted eagle rays are dangerous! Look what they did to Steve Irwin! Things that come from journals are spooky! So, go get where you came from! Ah! Uh, if Dipper was here, maybe I'd know what to do. I am literally just standing here. But at the same time, he's just so fuzzy, and he's like, Mabel, you can't do this, and Mabel, you can't do that. Well, I know how these things are, see, because I have to deal with little man and little man girl edition at home. <laughs> Man rays could have families or thoughts in those little water filled brains. I'm starting to feel like this is coming from a place of prejudice. Oh! Um, if we fill up your friendship meter, then maybe we can send you back home. So, uh, first thing, friendship bracelets. I don't have hands or wrists, just my flap flaps. <laughs> oh, I know. What about one of my favorite activities? High level vocal mixing. You see, you just mess with the audio settings until it sounds right. Isn't it fun? <laughs> Am I doing right? Oh no, you're right, right? Right! Yes, this is fire. <laughs> okay, um, next thing, boy talk! Well, me and my boyfriend, Bigger Man. No way! <laughs> I had a boyfriend too, but he kind of had to go away. Well, you know how it is, kiddo. There are plenty of fish in the sea. <laughs> oh! <laughs> The ultimate act, a super duper friendship hug! Come here, you! Oh. Well, it's possible. No! Statistical ramifications for my actions! All right, all right, I'm going. Yes, oh no, it's me, Bernard, and definitely not Megamind in a clever disguise. I'm definitely not performing an illegal move in chess. I think that is Megamind in a clever disguise performing an illegal move in chess. Identity theft is not a joke. <laughs> Excuse me, did you not hear him? That's clearly Bernard, not Megamind in a disguise cheating at chess. So for what side are you on? Oh, I'm on the left. I'm pretty sure you are stage right. You know, why do you always let that cavalier boss you around all the time? Someone has to make him feel good about himself. And why should you care about that? You're the smart one. He should be taking orders from you. Comparatively. No! I can't take this weird boy freak anymore. Oh, Mr. Funny White Boy, save me! Uh, I better be getting paid overtime for this. Hey, Jana. Hello. Megamind's lesser men he needs to be handled with. Think you can handle it? I can handle a gullible salesman, no problem. Oh, I can throw shade now. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, I think we just. I'm not afraid to do it again. Oh, I'm not a computer. Or a robot, for that matter. Then what are you? Some sort of... Philo from Progressive Knockoff? <laughs> Close, but again, not a girl. Well, you'll be screaming like one when I'm done with you. Sorry. Well, I can't exactly feel human emotions, like pain, or fear, or sadness. But here's my best impression of a human crying. Oh, <laughs> God, that's annoying. Earplugs right about now. Oh, there you go. What? What's this? This wasn't an inventory. I have an endless void inside me that I can use to materialize objects to help make your life easier. Huh. Maybe this busty Alexa could actually be useful. <laughs> no, I shouldn't get distracted. You know, once when I was on Earth, I didn't know something. I had to ask Alexa. I felt dirty. You must have felt 32 when everyone at the office found out you were cheating with Angela, right? What'd you say? How do you know about that? I'm 
an anthropomorphized vessel of knowledge. It is my job to know everything. You have knowledge of the infinite universe, and you chose that outfit. Uh, the 70s call, they want their flight attendant back. <laughs> Didn't Jim say your whole ensemble only cost $11 to recreate? Here, let me do some more research on some more modern fashion for you. Huh? What was that? Sorry, I thought I heard Pam for a second, because all I'm hearing is a washed up secretary. Says the social outcast who projects himself onto his co-workers to feel a false sense of superiority. Don't go thinking you're that perfect either. I've seen your little show, and I've seen better philosophical undertones from a middle schooler's interpretation of Catcher in the Rye. Well, at least we knew when to end our show. We didn't milk it for more seasons. God, I had enough of this Google Home wannabe. Michael! Oh, that's funny. I work for a man named Michael. <laughs> Harder than it has to be. Can't we just put this to bed? <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> why are you making this so difficult? I just want to kill you. Oh, why didn't you say that sooner? Follow me. <laughs> just press the button right here and it's goodbye, Janet. That's oddly convenient. I do have to warn you though, as you approach the button, I will start to beg for my life. Just the fail safe though. It's very convincing. Do I know? Please, 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 do I have kids? That's pathetic. Again, Dwight, I am not human. And this is AI generated image of what Merlin fans look like because Christmas Eve will never be the same for them again. Yeah! Have you forgotten I work in customer service? I don't have any remorse. That was easy. Now, I only have seconds to harvest. <laughs> Composition man, food for the plants, like my mom, circle of life. Now, uh, move up to F3. How fine the secret of the lict is if it means cutting a path straight through to your king. Oof, bone lady is starting to freak me out here. A little too close for comfort. Hunter, live up to your namesake and take her out for me. I could not be further from you. Exactly, too close. Glad we came to this agreement. Please, <laughs> I don't want to fight anymore. Come now, don't you want to see your friend again? <laughs> Do you recognize the skeleton? Take a long, hard look at the bone structure. Why are you doing this? Don't you think I've been through enough? What sick kicks are you getting from this? You think I enjoy this? You think I enjoy any of this? I'm here to win, and if that means killing you, I'll do anything it takes. You can do anything it takes, but you've crossed the line. I won't let you have this sick pleasure. Done hesitating then? Good. If you're going to swing that back at me, you'd better not miss. I won't be bested by a coward who won't even show her face! Shut up. This rictus is the mark of a ninth house bone addict. And your blood sigils look pathetic. Aren't you supposed to be the cavalier? I'm not supposed to be anything! Aren't you supposed to have a partner? She is of literally no consequence. I don't need her or anyone. I was like you once. Angry. Bitter. Alone. Don't you want your fans to at least headcanning you in a successful relationship? No. <laughs> I want to be a litter. Do you have any idea you lost 
to get me here. Do you have any idea what is lost if I quit? So that's your justification? So cost! Do you have any idea how pathetic that is? You can turn it all around. We don't have to fight anymore. We can stop! Unlike you, I don't abandon my duties. The ninth house will die without me. I will not let my house wither away. Who exactly will miss you when you die? My friends! My very found family! Trans masks on Tumblr! <laughs> I inspire people! You just bring them to your level. No one is on my level. No one ever should be. If you're so happy with yourself now, I suggest you just die now and save yourself the heartbreak. No. I'm tired of being told what to do. I won't run anymore. I refuse to be the company to your misery. That's fine. It's not like anyone's ever offered before. Goodbye. God, I shouldn't have even spoken. What the? I can't move. Can't breathe. It's not strong enough. Oh God, Gideon. Gideon, if only I. If only. successful on BBC. Uh, hey, is it alright if I move back a bit? I'm not really suited for the spotlight. I can let you move to G5. It, it's the space right next to you. Uh, I really need to stop pledging my service to powerful beings. This is just getting ridiculous. Oh, you mean me? The most powerful, handsome one on the board? Well, I mean, out of the goddess of nature, the goddess of death, and my friend's grandma that one time, you're the only other one who's trapped me in a game for your amusement. What's you up there? We take those sort of wins. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Don Hog, it's time. Dragon up. What? March, now isn't the time for games. Oh, which piece to move? Which piece? Oh, look, another crazy distraction. Oh, how tragic, you just missed it. Did he just move across the whole stage? Is this allowed? What are you talking about? I haven't moved this entire time. You're crazy and no one will believe you. That doesn't sound right, but I failed my perception check, so it works for me. <laughs> Clearly, you don't have a 31 passive perception like I do. Say, excuse my tone earlier. Would a thousand dollars be enough for me to pass by you then? Fine, but with money like that, you might as well use my super cool and super convenient transportation method. Oh, an artist. <laughs> Whatever. A, I can do your job way better than you. <laughs> excuse you. AI art is not art. It is blatant exploitation of the artistic community. <laughs> You should be ashamed of yourself. 
I don't feel any shame. So typically, paper goes for 50 gold per slot, but I can get you paying 25 gold per slot, easy monthly payments if you work with me. You know, that's a suspiciously good deal, but I trust a paper salesman wouldn't scam a wizard who knows fireball. Don't worry. <laughs> We're chained in fire safety. <laughs> Stop speaking nonsense. It's very offensive to the wizarding community. J.K. Rowling would be very displeased. <laughs> Mother said I must take my vitamins before exercising. Let's do this! What's the matter, Topher? No bitches? Sure, this is not the real Christopher Columbus. Oh! What are you going to do? Stab me? <laughs> are you going to want this back? <laughs> the situation is getting critical. <laughs> oh, did you lose a fight with a cloning machine or something? Nope. Oh! I'll have you know I've been trained to kill since birth. <laughs> I think what you really need right now is a goth mommy. I like men. Not a person, just a writer. <laughs> I'm not a wizard, but whole person. Fail spell slot. <laughs> Son, you just ain't profitable anymore. <laughs> I don't like that this guy has a gun now. I don't either. <laughs> this is the part where you fall down, Bernie. I finally won! Oh, Topher Buzz! You are the strongest, most attractive, most politically correct, and most microplastic-filled human being on Earth. Thank you, current President Abraham Lincoln. You're welcome, Topher Buzz. Topher! 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 What even happened? Flintstone vitamin gummies. <laughs> and that's what caused this skill issue. <laughs> well, the only thing I've seen meet is dino nuggies, so... We should just move him away. This is quite sad. <laughs> okay, down no, no. While everyone's distracted, it's time to drag him up. Marge, for the last time, I don't know what that is. You know when you transform, become cool and immortal and stuff? Ooh, you're immortal? Uh, yeah, I guess. Really? I'm trying to find the secret to immortality so I can save my clan. Can I take you home hey, with me? I can't me? let you do that. That one's my friend. You can't just take him. I can trade. What do you want for him? A hundred thousand stellar J. Marge. <laughs> I thought you said you couldn't put a price tag on friendship. Well, that's how much I spend on your banner. Plus, I want sparkle. I don't think I have any of those, but I can give you money? Do you have money in space? Mm, well, we already have too many credits, but I'll take your cat for him. <gasps> Never! Marge, that's a panda. And why are you going along with this? Hey, how about you give me a bunch of relics? You have relics where you're from, right? I don't, but I have this. I can trade you my immortal guy for yours. He's really powerful and really dangerous, so I have to promise you'll be really careful with him. Do I get any say in this at all? Do either of us get any say in this? Why is this? Shh. The adults are talking. <laughs> I'm older, and you're negotiating with an 11-year-old. 11 and a half, thank you very much. 
Hey, didn't you and that other lady say something about being able to create things? Oh, like with my Alka history? I can try, but I don't know if it'll work. If I make you some of those space jade things that you want, can I have him? Hmm, 10k in the drive. Deal. No! Oh. Pleasure doing business with you. I like you. You're a lot nicer than Envy. How are you immortal anyway? It's, it's not like immortal, like not dying. It's like I die and then I turn into an egg and then I am alive again. So you're not immortal. You're just a metaphor for generational trauma. <laughs> I want my stuff back. No, too late. Are you lost? You get it back. It's my follow-up. What am I supposed to do? Not shoot her? <laughs> we can't just put holes in things to solve all our problems. Well, that's what happened to you, and you became a cool mortal dragon and stuff. Okay, let's just do something about this jar before it does something to us. Good idea. Ooh, I got sparkle. <laughs> Game, move over to G4, please. Are you sure, Master? I can smell corpses, but all I smell there is Topher's B.O. Are you saying that Topher smells worse than a corpse? That can't be. Oh! Oh gosh, she's right. Oh. <laughs> oh, I don't feel so good. I flew up. <laughs> I think she's under the poison condition. For any attack Shinigami, you'll have advantage. Wait, 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 wait! You want me to fight the Death God? No, 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 I can't do that! Oh no, please don't kill me! Oh, we don't have to fight. How about I possess you for the rest of your life instead? Oh wait, you mean like some sort of eternal friend? Well, what sort of price would I have to pay? Oh, nothing much. Just your very own memories. Even the super traumatic ones that keep you up at night, tormenting you as you lock yourself away from the world. Oh, you betcha! You just got a sign here, here, and oh, this one's in case you don't sue us. Wait, death gods can be sued? We haven't been doing well since the death note incident. <laughs> oh, perfect, you're done! Now, how about you like to Mystery for me. Mystery? Why? What? What? <laughs> Down the rabbit hole we go! Just exit the mystery labyrinth. 
No more need, but you'll gain all of your memories back. Wait, what? While you have your little existential crisis, I'll just sleep in the book of death for the unforeseeable future. Memories, huh? I wonder what sort of memories I forgot. Bye, Doctor! And don't trip on your childhood trauma on the way out! <laughs> <sighs> I hope the person I possess is a lot more interesting. Maybe a main character with a purple lahoge. to the weed. around the target. Visualize it and repeat after me. Immolation. Right. Sounds easy enough. Just say the words and poof, right? Uh, immolation. D did, I, did I do it? Ow! Ow! Perhaps I shouldn't have started him on a sixth level spell. <laughs> Merlin, why am I on the ground? Merlin? Merlin! Who did this? What happened? Was it you? Uh, technically, he did it to himself. How dare you lie to me? Uh, now look, I'm sure I have a healing spell in my spell book somewhere. No, no, it was me. It was me. It was magic to protect you. <laughs> you, magic. Don't be ridiculous. Arthur, don't fight him. Magic, it can help you. Just rest. You're delusional. You don't know what you're saying. You'll be all right. Arthur, for once, just listen. Yes, please, listen to him. Merlin. Merlin. Merlin! How dare you take him from me! Mirror image! Shake stone! I've done this before, why isn't it working now? Phantasmal killer! Because you're not worthy of the crowd. Father, no. No, you're not real. This isn't real. You can't be. It's... Oh. No, this isn't our destiny. Uh, that was a nasty bit of business. Uh, take me up. Cast me away. 
All right. Institutionalized religion's never been my thing. <laughs> Fair, but the last few times I've heard that, I've lost my husband, been betrayed, died, so I just don't think we see eye to eye on the issue. Very well. Roll for initiative! <laughs> 18. Dang, 14. Ha! Poison spray! <laughs> Good try, but I faced worse than that. Let's wrap this up. I have like eight different crises to deal with. Fines! Using nature against me? That's cruel, man. Oh. Looks like you've lost. Using gravity against me is what's cruel. I gotta admit, that was pretty good. We're just getting started. Check that out! Fate and switch! <laughs> what on earth is going on? Hysteria, have you turned on me? Uh, no, quite the opposite. I don't know why I'm here, so... I'm just going to leave. Good luck with that! <laughs> I've had enough of this. Uh, Quint! My I, enemy! I summon geese with the stats of raptors! What? Is that you? You're back too soon. Well, I'm sorry. I couldn't avenge you. No, Mr. K. 
crow dragon dog. Not this again. Hey, good to see you online, lobster boy underscore underscore. <laughs> I've had an excruciating day trapped in some strange dimension. A different one than usual, actually. Ugh, oh, tell me about it. Did you have the chance to observe my newest piece on Twitter, Excuse Me X? Uh, yeah, I thought the use of color was interesting. I sense some dishonesty. Do be honest with me, Mantaro. As artists, we can only grow. It insists upon itself. <laughs> that is dreadfully vague. What, pray tell me, does that even mean? It just takes itself too seriously, I'm sorry. Interesting. Well, I do not want to be the one to say it, but I do believe you are milking your latest track to the point of ennui. Look, it's not my fault that things got out of hand with the paparazzi. I'm a big time audio producer now. Love, Sir Boy. I thought you'd be proud of me. Clearly, fame is going to your head. You wrote a song without your team and then wrote a song sampling from them and gave them no credit. But you we're stole from them. We're a band, I, and I was using an alias, but I mean, I'm not even ENBGM, so. I should never dream of stealing from my team and then hiding behind a foolish nickname. I only steal from criminals while hiding behind a foolish nickname. <laughs> stealing from criminals. I'm a criminal. Then I suppose I shall have to steal your heart, old friend. Oh, you're human. Like that one earlier. Oh, uh, I killed her. No, I'm a fox, a very artistic fox. Oh, okay. But what is your crime? Uh, well, I pirated FL Studio. <laughs> oh, you stole from a greedy corporation. That is cool. And Vocaloid, <laughs> and Vocaloid 6, and Pro Tools, and of course Chevy OAR. Perhaps stop while you're ahead. Oh, we've been friends for so long, buddy. I can't stay mad at you. Bring it in. Perhaps not. I did see what happened to the last person you attempted to hug. Ah, uh, yeah, that, that's fair. Let us part ways as comrades in the arts. No, no, no. That's not how this works. I'll have to eliminate both of you. What? Sir, you can't. I'm on your team. I have stood beside you. What are you going to do? Dehydrate us? Wrong neurotoxins. <laughs> <laughs> Shiver. Fry. My family. Get out of here, big man. But you'll die. Just go for both of us. <laughs> Please, someone. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Prison, the true makings of a supervillain. Wow, you also grew up in prison? Oh, a fellow evildoer? Maybe we aren't so different after all. I wouldn't say evil, I'd say... Uh, March, what would you say that made me? Traumatized? Yeah, that. 
I just so happen to have the perfect coping mechanism for trauma, with no downsides whatsoever. And what's that? Crime. <laughs> just imagine a whole brick city at your feet. I don't know about that. Uh, listen, we'll start small. Here, try jaywalking. It's perfectly fine. Everyone does it. Okay. I don't get it. No, not the shape of a J. Yeah, May here will show you how it's done. It's March. According to the script, it's January. How do people do that? How do they cross that through text? I see it all the time and no one ever tells me. June here will show you how it's done. <laughs> Close enough. Now you try. Uh I'm gonna, I'm gonna litter. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not cool. Yeah, we want a world to rule after all. We will do it by using public Wi-Fi and putting ice cream in our back pockets on Sundays. Yeah. Wait, it's not Sunday yet. <laughs> I'm sorry, we? Yes, I'm bringing you two on as my lesser minions, so a step above that Dwight fella. Oh yeah. I don't know about that. I like doing crime was fun, but being a minion is kind of a big commitment. That's fair. But have you considered? Please, 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 please. Help me out there. All right. Please, 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 please. Okay. All right. We'll do a little crime for you as a treat. As long as you stop eating nickels. Yay! <laughs> Ooh, a nickel! I don't know why I try. <laughs> you know, that's not how chess works, but since this is all just a framing device and we're following none of the rules anyways, I guess you can have them. You seem to be running low anyways. Ooh, shiny. Mark, what did you do? Finally, it's time for the Dimmer Thunderdome. <laughs> Hysteria, Bernadetta, stop whatever he's up to. Ooh, this should be fun. Ladies, gentlemen, and otherwise, introducing our fine contestants this evening, Asterian Ankunen and Bernadette von Varley. Why am I here? Just to suffer? Uh, yes, yes you are. Suffering happens to be my specialty. <laughs> Would you be a dear and let me have advantage on one attack? I'm sorry. Where are you apologizing? I'm sorry. Stop saying that you're sorry. I'm sorry for apologizing. What did I just Say, gods, it's like talking to a whimpering brat. How old are you? I'm 17. Excuse me? You, you're... Hey, Dimma whatever. Dimma don't. I Dimma don't care. You did not tell me that I would be fighting an actual child. I'm not killing any more children, not with an audience. <laughs> so what if she's a little behind? You've got a foster. Foster? Look at it! It has anxiety! <laughs> I think what you two little murderers need is a bit of familial encouragement. Which has given me the perfect chance to thank today's Dimma sponsors. <laughs> Lord Casador and Count Varley. What? what? Uh, no! He, he didn't! He Dimma did! He's gonna wish he Dimma did it! Go on, you two. <laughs> She's not listening to me. Killing her would be so much easier, but fine, maybe this will work. Charm person, feel like listening to me now? Yes, sir. Oh, some manners, how delightful. Now, here's what I have in mind. I take issue with one of our sponsors. You seem to take issue with the other, yes? Very, very much. Wonderful, so how about we take care of this Dimma Dingbat, we get out of here, I get to kill Casador, you don't have to die, we both win. I, I think that could work. Then we can go home, right? I really don't want to be here anymore. Can't help but notice you two are chatting instead of fighting. 
This isn't what all these fine folk paid forty dollars pay per view for. <laughs> if you need more encouragement, I can get some more sponsors. I think the only thing you're encouraging us to do is to attack you instead. How funny! I was just thinking the same thing. Keep his attention for me, won't you, dear? Well, looks like you two are dim and disqualified. The punishment for breaking my fair game is dim and death. <laughs> Tell my son, Dale Dimidome, heir to the Dimstale Dimidome and Dimstale. He is now Dale Dimidome, owner of Dimstale Dimidome. <laughs> Take this, the deed to the Dimstale Dimidome. Give it to Dale Dimidome so he may inherit the Dimstale Dimidome. The deed to the Dimstale Dimidome. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Meant, I totally could have used that death arena when I was losing. I mean, winning, but just a little bit slower than that first time. Attention! Master Dimidon has been murdered. Funding has been cut. Self distract mode imminent. All exits have been locked. Man, I should have known RET would have cut our budget if we weren't marketable enough. <laughs> Super jump isn't working. We can't get out of here. My misty step doesn't seem to be working either. Anyone have any bright ideas? Well, the smart thing usually is to defer to the leader of the party. Daniel, help, please! I can give it a shot. Ah, uh, yes! What I first think of when I think of vicious, bloodthirsty problem solvers, a bunch of inanimate ducks! <laughs> well, when nature fails, Science never dies! Eh. <laughs> no! Science has failed me! If only the heart of our party were here, they'd know what to do. They always have the strangest way of saving the scummiest of situations. <laughs> well, they're not here, are they, Gail? Knowing them, they're probably over in Cumbert, somewhere near the artist alley, picking up every bit and bob that's not nailed down. One of these days, I need to buy them a bag of holding, if only so that I can find out what happens if I shove a wizard into it. <laughs> you say that as if you don't do the same thing. That is not the point! <laughs> Wow, everyone. You somehow managed to break all safety protocols. Yay! <laughs> you got the weakness break. No, Marge, it's more like you got the weakness break on us. Oh, man. Speaking of weakness break. <laughs> since our leaders here have been so incompetent, I decided to take measures into my own hands. Lesser minion, what do you think you're doing? I'm so sick and tired of you calling me your lesser minion. I think it's finally time I took some power at mother fork and shirt balls. I, I rebooted. Is that the nightmare crown we've been looking for? A crown, huh? Fitting for such a prestigious employee as myself. I think it's about time I got a promotion. No! Hey. He hasn't just become a villain. He's become a supervillain! What's the difference? PowerPoint presentation! <laughs> what dark sorcery is this? It's the most evil thing imaginable. Corporate America. <laughs> like Meester's Grace. I need you guys to handle him. We need to get that crown back. That's it. I'm tired of losing my friends to this stupid chess game. Even though I don't want to hurt anybody. Mabel, Yusuke, I will avenge you! Big man, I really think we're gonna have to kill this guy this time. Hey. Oh, words from someone who doesn't have an official Lego minifigure. <laughs> <laughs> it's all started when we broke that box. Maybe we can fix it. The doors will unlock. Asteria, you're good with traps, right? You're the one with 18 intelligence. My intelligence stat was only I to make me a viable arcane trickster. Uh, <laughs> You're doing that wrong. I'm sorry, do you have a PhD? A uh, do you? Shut up. <laughs> Let's see if any of these buttons unlock the doors. 
Well, this one says lights off. <laughs> and this one says lights on. <laughs> oh, this one summons the stage ninjas. <laughs> this one builds a hockey arena. This one destroys a library. They're the same button. <laughs> This one releases the full, concentrated power of the sun! No, 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 not again! <laughs> so, you're telling me none of these buttons unlocks the doors? You know, we wouldn't be having this problem if Larry would just add Artificer to the game already. The modders already took care of that one, Gail! I'm not a cheater, historian! I'm not cheating, man! I'm purely cosmetic! <laughs> yeah. Prepare to be downsized. But if I wasn't big man, I'd just be male. <laughs> Sometimes I got to fend the woman off with a stick. Back me up. How did we not realize how misogynistic he was? He looked a lot better while Topher was still here. <laughs> Respect women! Janet, weapon! <laughs> There's a cactus. It'll work! <laughs> that would be a really nice time to help out! Dragon! What's that noise? So bad. Maybe 
maybe the real nightmare crowd were the friends we made along the way. <laughs> that was the plan, sir. Minion, do you mean to tell me you orchestrated this entire elaborate chess death match that led to dozens being murdered or worse, all for me to make friends? Guilty. Oh, you <laughs> September and uh, we've had a blast doing it. Uh, we are RIT Cosplay Troop. We meet every Friday. Uh, we do cosplay uh, related activities, presentations, you know, all the works. Uh, we're just so thankful that you can uh, be here, that you choose to spend your time watching our little production and uh, thank you very much. Yeah. We have posters to commemorate the show. They'll be uh, sold for $10 each, and all the proceeds go to helping run more events like this. They will be sold right outside Bingo right after we get the board out of here. So if you want one, go meet us out there. And with that, I think it's time for our cast photo. Cast photo! Oh. 
you guys can't see my feet, right? <laughs> oh, I <I'm sorry. laughs> Just checking. Just your flat, flat. Just your flat, flat. Just your flat, flat. Just your flat, flat.